Hello, my beautiful soul family. This is Patricia 1111 coming to you today with your December 4th, 2022 reading. But remember, it could also be timeless, which means any time that anyone sees this will be the right time for them. So I shuffle the cards. I put a lot of good energy in it. And I ask the universe, what do you want to let everyone know here? Especially if you have a lot of questions. And for some of you haven't got your signs in what the universe wants to tell you. Well, first card up you got is the Six of Cups in Energy. There's uh, not, you know, Some of you are feeling nostalgic around this time, okay? and But the good part of the Six of Cups in Energy is that there's a healing and you're moving on. You're moving on. And you got the full card. So there is a new beginning that's there for you if you want to take this new beginning, okay, this path that is being opened towards you. And also you're seeing things on a different level when it comes to your connections of the past because of the healings and the closure that you have been doing. You have the Wheel of Fortune that's also coming in for you. And the Wheel of Fortune here talks about, well, something is coming in destined, faded, karma, luck, being at the right time at the right place. It's like almost that you're going through a reset. And, but a lot of you with the Six of Swords reversed feel that, you know, maybe at this time you're not seeing a way out of a situation. Okay. Um, you're returning to the Six of Cups and energy. Um, and maybe some of you are wanting to move or travel or relocate. Um, but what Spirit is saying here is definitely there is a new beginning. The Wheel of Fortune is there with you. Maybe you're feeling stuck in a situation. Uh, not to worry with the Six of Pentacles here. Is that whatever you have been putting out there, you will be receiving. Something is coming into balance. You did get 666, which is a number of prosperity. Then I asked, with the Sword of Light and Energy, what is your message here? And it says, make a decision. And it says, are you choosing to prioritize yourself or another in this situation? Accept divine's guidance, pointing you towards your own joy. You deserve it. And again, you have the scales over here. Justice. Something is coming into balance. Then I asked, what does your higher self want you to know? And you got here number 25, which is a seven. It says, protect what you love. It is your duty and responsibility. You also got with the Sword of Light, number 19, which is equals to a 10, new beginnings. And what the universe wants you to know is that there's an external party here, karmic contracts, family finances, and other material concerns or responsibilities are causes of interference and stress. I hope that this helped.